How is everyone doing? And welcome to yet another Fancy Friday featuring a silver certificate. Uh, this is one that has been, uh, let me think, when this video drops, I will have had this note about six weeks or so. And uh, this is a really cool one. This is a super radar. And what I mean by super radar, if you look at the serial number, radar means it reads the same forward as it does backward. And the super radar aspect is where the two outermost numbers, so the furthest left and the furthest right, are the same. And then all six of the middle numbers are the same. That's a super radar. Now, uh, this one happens to be on a 1957 silver certificate. Um, you can see the, the heavy crease in the middle. I'll show you the back here. Well, it's not working as it was. But right here, it's the back. It's a lot, you know, it's just like our dollars today. And uh, if you'll tune back in next week, I'll have another one to show you where that in God we trust is actually not there. And uh, those are more on the 1935s. I'm actually about to film that video too. But a note like this, and this note kind of has a story anyway. But a note like this is valued in about that $150 range because of it being a super radar. Uh, silver certificate radars are tough to find. A lot of them you can get for about $75 to $100. Bucks. But with it being a super, um, it does add some decent value to it. Um, the, the thing or the story with this note is, if I could actually get it to work for a second so I can go hands-free. I like to talk with my hands, by the way. So if you ever see me just moving around doing that stuff, I'm talking with my hands. Um, so I found this on eBay and it had, I want to say the guy wanted like $195 for it, something like that. And I sent him an offer for uh, $150 and he accepted it. So, you know, I paid him and just like through PayPal, that kind of thing and didn't hear anything, continued to not hear anything. So I waited about four days and, uh, you know, waited through the weekend. And the Monday after I I uh, got the note or, or won the bid on the note, basically, uh, I sent him an email and said, hey, are you going to ship this? What's the deal? And didn't hear anything. And then I finally heard from him and said, I'll ship when I get paid. And it was uh, it was a really kind of a weird thing. And it was through eBay. And, you know, I thought maybe someone's wires got crossed. Maybe PayPal's holding, has a hold on the money or something. I didn't know. And that's all I ever heard from the guy. And ultimately it took about, about 15 days to get this note. And, you know, most first class mail, it was sent first class, most first class mail right now, it's working on about a four day uh, rate. And, he never provided me with a tracking number. It just honestly showed up. I was about 24 hours away from reporting the guy to eBay for, you know, not sending the note and trying to get my money back. But luckily he did. I'm not trying to throw anyone under the bus, but it's not really the way you uh, you run a business. And he's got tons of notes on eBay. And something sad is he actually relisted this note. This exact note is for sell on eBay right now, but he does not own it. I own it. And obviously I have it here in my possession, you know, there, there's movement, there's my hand on the screen. So I have this note, but uh, hopefully he doesn't swindle someone out of the money, but I'm glad I have it in my possession. It's just a killer fancy to have. Super uh, radars are awesome to have on any type, you know, legal tenders, federal reserves, whatever, but there's just something about those old school silver certificates that makes them, uh, I don't know, it's really, really nice. But I hope you guys have a good fancy Friday and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.